All right, good morning, everyone, and welcome uh, to our Flag Day ceremonies here today at City Hall. It's a pleasure to have everyone with us, uh, enjoying the beautiful amphitheater here as part of our new uh, City Hall Plaza. I uh, appreciate everyone being here. This is another one of our uh, key celebrations that we have uh, throughout the course of the year, and I know for myself personally, uh, just coming a couple weeks after Memorial Day, and as, as mayor, you participate in five or six different Memorial Day observances over the course of the morning, and uh, it, it really causes you to take a few minutes to think about the sacrifices that have been made over so many years so that we can uh, enjoy what we enjoy here today uh, in our country. So uh, it's most appropriate that we uh, gather here on City Hall Plaza today uh, to recognize Flag Day. And I'll ask us uh, to open up this morning's ceremonies. If everyone could please rise and join me in the Pledge of Allegiance. And I think we should probably use this flag because of the fact that the other one is not raised right now. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you. If, if everyone could please remain standing uh, while the Brockton High School Concert Choir performs our nation's national anthem. Mr. Cunningham, thank you so much. And we'll ask the concert choir to uh, remain in place because they have a uh, couple of patriotic songs to perform for us uh, this morning. Uh, please be seated. I do want to take a moment to uh, acknowledge and recognize uh, elected officials joining us here this morning. Uh, City Councilor at Large, Shana Barnes, and Ward 6 Councilor Jack Lally. <laughs> Councilors, thank you very much for being here with us today. Uh, our keynote speaker this morning, uh, who uh, does Flag Day, American Flag, better than anyone I know. That's why he uh, appears every year. It's my pleasure to introduce Navy SEAL, Lieutenant Commander, retired, Tony O'Brien. Thank you, Mayor. Appreciate it, sir. Wow, what a beautiful morning. God bless America. And it's so nice to, uh, to have the kids here. And I know you're, you're big old high school students, but to m most of us, you're still kids. And uh, tell you what, enjoy that. Keep that. Definitely keep that. <clears throat> Great job. Happy Flag Day to all with us and those who couldn't be with us. Thank you to Mayor Carpenter and local leaders in the city we love for the chance to share brief thoughts on Flag Day, June 14th. Congratulations to Brockton a leader in ceremony celebrating the heritage of many nationalities all year, including recently honoring Haitians and Italians. Today, we honor the American flag that brings us all together, a symbol for freedom, bravery, and leadership. What is the flag? It's America. Like America, Brockton has always been a melting pot of nationalities. In the 1970s, Anthony O'Brien grew up on the north side of Brockton. 
half Italian, half Irish, in a Jewish neighborhood, in a Polish family. Not an unusual story here in a city of champions, patriots, immigrants, and reminded on this gorgeous morning with all of these flags flying, a city of flags. Polish, you ask? My mom died when I was age six, and my dad remarried into a wonderful Polish family from the east side, between the Swedes on the south side and the Lithuanians on the north side. That diverse heritage remains and is joined by many hardworking, patriotic Cape Verdeans, Dominicans, Brazilians, Haitians, and many others. What is the flag? It's America. The flag, the flag is a symbol of our love for country, and we can love more than one country, like family, when we love more than one family member, parents, spouse, children. Americans are not just born here. All of our families have a heritage of immigrants. Those who died for our country are heroes. Those who fought for our freedom are warriors. And those who support them are also patriots. And we need each other. Everyone contributes in some important way. So the flag is a powerful symbol of our unique, I'm sorry, the flag is a powerful symbol of our unique history of and unity for freedom instead of just a piece of fabric. Freedom is worth fighting for, freedom is worth dying for, our lives should uphold those amazing ideals. In closing, the red represents depth of sacrifice, white represents purity of intention, and the blue represents their result, the beauty of freedom that we enjoy to do things like we're doing today. What is the flag? It's America. God bless patriots. God bless Brockton. God bless America. Thank you and happy Flag Day. Uh, thank you, Tony. Outstanding. Uh, at this time, I'd like to also acknowledge uh, some more of our elected officials here this morning from our state legislative delegation. State Representative Michelle Dubois is here. And also joining us is State Senator Michael Brady. Senator, thanks for being here this morning. Uh, at this time, I'd like to turn things back over to Mr. Cunningham uh, so that uh, Brockton High School Concert Choir uh, can perform God Bless America. Outstanding. At this time to officially recognize Flag Day here in the city of Brockton, uh, it is my privilege and honor to issue a proclamation on behalf of the city. Whereas for more than 200 years the American flag has been a proud symbol of the people of our nation and the values for which we stand. And whereas 
in hues of red, white, and blue. It reflects centuries of struggle and sacrifice, a constant reminder of our journey from 13 colonies to a nation united in freedom and liberty, and of the patriots and pioneers who fought for these ideals at home and abroad. And whereas on Flag Day, we pay tribute to this banner of hope and opportunity, and we celebrate the story of progress it represents. And whereas today, it is because of an unbroken chain of heroes who have served in our armed forces and worn the flag they defend, that old glory still waves over the land of the free and the home of the brave. Now, therefore, I, Bill Carpenter, as mayor of the city of Brockton, do hereby proclaim today, June 14th, as United States Flag Day. I urge all residents of the city of Brockton to recognize this momentous occasion and to honor America by wearing red, white, and blue and displaying the flag in your home. Signed and sealed uh, by me today, June 14th, 2016. And at this time, uh, Lieutenant Commander, I'd like to present the official uh, proclamation to you today. Now, if the, uh, if the elected officials and others uh, and Lieutenant Commander would like to join us, we'll raise the American flag, and then we'll have a, uh, another performance by the Brockton High Concert Choir. So let's raise the flag. Thank you so much to the members of the Brockton High School Concert Choir. Uh, and you'll notice that uh, we, we raised the flag all the way and then lowered it to half staff at the direction of Governor Baker in memory of the victims of Orlando. Um, no, uh, Orlando, right, yeah, okay. Uh, this will conclude our Flag Day ceremonies. Thank you so much for being here. And again, thanks to uh, Lieutenant Commander O'Brien and the Brockton High School Concert Choir for helping us celebrate Flag Day today. Thank you. Great job, guys.